to the Dumb Bones play Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. I almost forgot the name, and I'm Christine. I'm Andrew. And I'm Zagger. And we are back. Yes, it's been a long hiatus. A lot of shit has gone on. See the most well, recent Pokemon the episode room. for details. No, this is not the treasure room. Well, I don't have the card. Yeah, well, you gotta go to the first key room. This is the last key room. So it's been a while, and Moana came out. Yeah, Moana was... Where is my map? No, well, it's... That's not gonna happen if you keep going up press to that start. door. Yeah, press uh, start. honey, I... press there start. We World map. I okay. feel like she's trying to get us to just take the controller from her. It's not gonna happen, hon. <laughs> is, it is it that one? <laughs> you, you, gotta, you gotta go up or right. Keep going up or right. Please take me out of my misery. No. And, uh... So anyway, yeah, Moana we came out. We could get Temator to come in here. And well, he hasn't always been this grand. You know, he was a drab little crab once. I swear, I swear we're mispronouncing it so bad. I'm sure we are. I'm pretty sure they mis- By the way, so I didn't notice this, but a friend of mine noticed it, Moana. Go, Three go times down. Moana mispronounces Maui's name. She says oh. Moe three times. Does well, she? Yes. Which I'm not. I'm not gonna hate on the. Out, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> I uh left. See. Leave me alone. I hate this game. <laughs> well, tough. You gotta play it until you die honorably. <laughs> and then if we die honorably again, you gotta play it again. Mm -hmm. Or if we die on purpose. But this doesn't apply to you. Yeah, only to you it <laughs> yeah. doesn't apply. We so if I die on purpose, I get extra turns. But if but we if you die, die on purpose, purpose I you get extra turns. <laughs> <laughs> See, here's the difference. I hate you people. See, here's the difference. We want to live and not die. She gets to play with her favorite character. It's <laughs> me. Are all the students starting to look the same? You're telling me fucking sore. Wait, you know what I just realized? <laughs> they could put Moana in Kingdom Hearts 3. Cause all no, the, they can't. Yeah, they it, can. I think it's too late. No, the reason late. they ca can is because... Uh, the people at Square Enix get to watch Disney films before. Yeah, we, we know that, but they've all, they said a while ago that they had already planned it all out. I don't think they're going to add it, anything in. Maybe in Kingdom Hearts 4. Well, the reason I say it's possible is because uh, last week or something like that, Tetsuya Nomura said there's still a lot of development that needs to be done. They haven't even uh, started on some of the worlds. I love how Pan thinks we're pirates. Yeah. For, aren't we with uh, Tinkerbell? Yeah. Shouldn't it, the look fact how little faith he has in his friend Tinkerbell. Yeah, what a dick. Tinkerbell, go find help. Oh, she brought back pirates, the stupid bitch. <laughs> it, and as... You know, he should not be insulting Tinkerbell. That'll make Christine angry. I just uh, realized the music is... Way too loud. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you were real pirates, you wouldn't get lost on your own ship. Well, if you were a real boy, you'd would dress like an elf. Do you, you tell them butter. You stutter. Study. You tell them butters. <laughs> butters. <laughs> yeah. That does sound like a butters thing to say. No one can capture Peter Pan. I was apprehended. So was anyone else surprised at Dwayne the Rock Johnson's performance as Maui? Um... Like, and you know, I, I like I've the scene voice. I've seen him act before, and I, he's never really disappointed me. I mean, well, Tooth Fairy was a terrible film, but hey, no one could have made that good. Yeah, um, yeah. <laughs> well, I don't, I don't mean like, like I've always thought he was a, a really good act, not like the at best. Well, I, I, I've, no Leonardo I've DiCaprio. only seen him voice act once. That was in a uh, Planet Fifty Two, I think. What's it called? Oh Planet? yeah, that where film. he plays the astronaut. And he did, a, he did a good job in that, actually. It's not a great film, honestly. It, I mean, it. I'm not surprised that he did a good job voice acting. It's just that... You know, it's whatever... Just that you, he, he became, like... It wasn't just, like, you constantly recognize that that's the Yeah, Yeah, when, usually when it's Dwayne The Rock Johnson, like, any picture of him, you immediately are able to notice, oh, that's Dwayne The Rock Johnson. When you hear his voice, you're usually able to really easily go, oh, that's Dwayne The Rock Johnson. But when I was watching the film... I, I like to immerse myself as I can, as for as much as I can, and I subconsciously kind of wasn't thinking about how he was in this film, and then when he came on screen, I was like, there's something about him that's familiar, and two seconds later, my brain went, oh yeah, that's Dwayne The Rock Johnson. You actually forgot that was Dwayne Johnson. Well, I, I just wasn't actively yeah, thinking about it. Yeah, that's a good thing, though, because yeah, it is a good he did thing. a great job. And his, and I'm going to find where the next room is. I think is. it's the red Bring up arrow. your map. Bring up your map. 
Bring up your map. <laughs> I'm the map, I'm the map, I'm the map. You need to get off the freaking ladder. No, I don't. Okay, um. You have to go right. No, Because yeah. you can't. Left. Go no, right. not left. That's the final. Follow the red remember. arrow. Never mind. Or fight these guys. This guy was like, is he going to get off the ladder? Is he going to stay on the ladder? I'm done waiting for you to make up your fucking mind. <laughs> uh, yeah, but it, that's because I think Dwayne Johnson was a great choice for that role. He's even, like, you know, of Polynesian descent, I think. Yeah. I mean, to, to me personally, that doesn't matter, especially if it's a voice actor. I know, role. I'm just saying it makes it more... It just, yeah, yeah, like, it, it makes it, like, fit together more easily. Yeah, it, do, it does make it fit better. I'm not saying it's a like, bad thing. If you're a talented enough voice actor, you can sound yeah, just like, about anything, like, friggin', like... Like, whoever did, uh, who, like, you know, half of Be Prepared wasn't even Jeremy Irons. It was another guy imitating his voice. Wasn't it the guy who did the, who was Winnie the Pooh who did that? Uh, probably, I think, was th was that Jim Cummings, maybe? I think it might in have the been. original film or the new one? In, in the original. The original Lion King. King. Oh, Be half Lion King. Be I, was thinking, I was thinking Be, uh, be Our Guest. Be Our Guest. Be Our Guest. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Yeah. So you remember when Lumiere say Be Prepared? <laughs> I know. Okay, let me. Yeah. Oh, I know that your powers of redemption are as wet as the warthog's backside, but thick as you are, pay attention. I mean, it's it would just be weird as shit. You know, the weird thing is that accent actually works really well for that song. <laughs> just just not a snobby ass French guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but thick as you are, pay attention. <laughs> My words are a matter of pride. <laughs> I mean, it is clear from your vacant American expression that the words are not all on upstairs. <laughs> I think we've just insulted everyone. So, uh, joining the Nicolas Cage covers will be Lumiere. <laughs> in, in not even the right movie. <laughs> oh, level nine level fire. Level nine fire, that's pretty good. That's pretty good, doing a good job. Yeah, things are going pretty well. Now you need to go downwards. Uh, no, you I need to go, go up. up. Oh. I was looking at the wrong door. Did you add the... Okay, you don't have to add the fire. Wait, are, are you no. sure you have to go out? Yeah, you yeah. do. It's up on the was right. It, was it a blue shiny door or a yellow shiny door? It what? was a shiny door. Go back and look. No, that's a blue shiny door. You need to go down. What is blue? It's like treasure and stuff. Oh, okay. Then, yeah, we don't want to go that way because we're go, saving that so, for... Yeah, go the well, Are we saving that for Roxas? I think we Yeah, we, we said Roxas, and that's in uh, Castle Spoilers! of Oblivion, I believe. No, I'm pretty... No, it's in uh, the Twilight Town. Twilight Town. Okay. Excuse well, this is me? why we have multiple people here to remember that shit. Besides, Zagger's the one who wants him. He's got to remember that shit. Yeah. Uh, Castle, going going Castle Oblivion is where you get super glide. <laughs> Just making treasure room so she doesn't have to fight anybody. I am sick and tired Gets of this severely game. Severely under level. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she she's purposely trying to get herself killed valiantly. Do we count this? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Don't start with me. I will choke hold all of you at once. Do you have any more calm bounty room? <laughs> no. Oh, you do. Yes, I do. Ah, and it's an eight, so she can do it. Fuck. Don't tell her. Right. Or she's not gonna do it. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm gonna. Something else. Don't use a random joker. Don't waste our Moogle rooms. We need blue cards, so don't waste too many of our blue cards. I will use as many as I want. No, right? no, because then we're gonna get stuck later. Yeah, we need them for the Do you last. wanna get stuck in this game? <laughs> Christine. Leave do, you alone. Want to, do you want to spend more time on this game or less? Leave Go me talk alone. to the Moogle, he'll give you free cards. One second, I'm getting money. Okay. No, but uh, I'm asking you, do you want yeah, to spend more time alone. on this game or less? Answer the question. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> I'm going to say she wants more time on yeah, this game. Yeah, more time. We have That's to leave me alone, man. We have to extend <laughs> these episodes now. All right, so an hour an episode, and we're not allowed to proceed in the story until three episodes have gone by. And um, Christine has to fit, has to kill off at least half of the dungeon room six times over. She has to wipe out every. She has to make every single room a fighting room. And, and if we kill the boss, we have to start all, all the way over from the beginning. Well, we got an eight. That's okay. All right. Is that really all? Buy anything well? or? Nah, we don't have that many Moogle points. I mean, we have Moogle points, but nah. Just continue on. It's a, it just, yeah, let's just... I'm just getting rid of a few things. Okay, get rid of... Oh, you've already gotten rid of all the attack cards under 7, I'm guessing. Yeah. Uh, okay, just, yeah, move on. Is there ever a point where you played with only attack cards of level 9? Uh, yes. 
Okay. You have too much time, time on your hands. You probably grinded a lot more. Yeah, I did. I, I was trying to get all the stuff, really. You need a nine. There's a nine. Dude, treasure rooms are so fucking hard to get. I mean, I, I've only seen... Literally, out of all the playthroughs I've watched people play this game, I've seen three treasure rooms. <laughs> and that's including ours. Yeah, seriously. I've, I mean... I got two in my own. Really? Lucky ass. Yeah, yeah because I've she got hates trash. the game, so the game gave her more. I got <laughs> such trash from it, though. Well, there she is! <laughs> there he is! Here's Johnny! <laughs> That's not creepy at all. I love how Wendy was standing, not even facing the door as people <laughs> burst through it. Just like, like well, she was it praying. sounds like something's going on, but I'm only halfway through my prayers, and I really want to get into heaven. <laughs> <laughs> I like how people react to heaven. It's more like, hey, you well, know, if here's they... Peter being an asshole now. So I, <laughs> um, I don't know. If yeah, the... you need your prayer. How dare you want to go back? To I don't know family. if this is going to be a show or a movie, but it's a really interesting thing. It's about a guy who uh, proves that uh, the afterlife is real. So a bunch of people just start killing themselves because it's like, what's the point of living in this world if we're just going to live in the afterlife, anyways? Wait, what now? It's either a show or a movie. It's an a this is an actual thing, and it's about this one guy who proves that the afterlife is real, and so everybody and. I assume he only proves there's heaven, there's no hell. So everybody just starts killing themselves. Okay, that sounds so awful. Well, and so the movie is about him trying to find people who haven't actually killed themselves yet. Or the show. It sounds like an interesting premise, but I don't know if it'll go yeah, for no, I've a got so while. much I still need to watch. I need to watch Walking Dead, I need to watch Westworld. <laughs> uh, all our comic book shows are starting up again soon. Yep. Yeah. Speaking of which, English they're moving doctor. Legends of Tomorrow to Tuesday. <clears throat> I don't get why, but whatever. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Why would you compete your shows with your own shows? You're competing Flash with Legends of Tomorrow now on because, Tuesday. Because crazy. Or maybe they just figure everyone will watch both anyway. Yeah, okay. I mean, I will, so. Yeah, I mean, the DC TV fan base is pretty dedicated, except for Constantine for some reason. <laughs> well, no, Constantine's fan base was super dedicated. It was the producers that weren't. Yeah. I mean, cause maybe if they had put that show on the CW instead of NBC, it would have done better. Yeah. Speaking of which, uh, I, I didn't know this until recently, and people are probably going to yell at me in the comments. You're an idiot. You should have known this. But you know, ABC is owned by Disney. You're an idiot. You should have known this. You really are um, an idiot. <laughs> well, then why are you complaining about ABC's budget for Inhumans? Because have you seen their shows? Yeah. They look terrible. Once Upon a Time looks pretty good. I haven't seen Once Upon a Time, and I don't uh, think it's going to be The effects are decent. Standard. Like, the effects on Chernabog weren't very good. I think they were pretty okay. Um... Okay, so wow, we're already finishing up Neverland. That was that was pretty damn quick. We've been, well, everything is quick in this game. That's the one good thing. Why for me to die valiantly? Yeah, wait, 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 that's why this this is an easy boss. If you die, it won't be. If valiant. you die, we'll know you. Die finished. valiantly! There you are, you rascals! When is the last time you've heard someone call people rascals? No, I mean he is a pirate from the 18th I'll century. I'll teach you to play stowaway on my ship. <laughs> Honestly, though. They really cartooned up Captain Hook. He's like, I, a, I, I, did you hear Donald's reaction when he goes, "You rascals, you're stowaways," and then Donald goes, "Are we his friends?" <laughs> he's like, I think that's what he said anyway. He's he said, like, I, mean, I think he said, "Are we his friends in relation to Peter Pan?" Uh, he's like that character from Bob's Burgers, the girl. Oh god, <laughs> the one who just like has the monotone voice and sounds like a guy, yeah. and I think is voiced by a guy, probably. Yeah! Did you see? He, he had an exclamation point. It's Solid Snake. He wants to battle! Captain Hook wants to battle. <laughs> well, that was poor planning. But now you'll see why I was the former circus champion. You'll see why I dressed this way. I used to be in the circus. <laughs> Seriously, the, like, they did cap cartoon on Captain Hook a lot in the film. It's not a bad thing. I like it. Well, I mean, Except for that time where he straight up murders one of his crew members for oh, yeah. singing. That was, uh, that was a little... Weird. As a kid, I was always like, did he kill him? Did that guy just slip that man's throat? And then there's that one live-action movie. I 
Pan? Don't ask me to properly describe. No, not Pan. Not Pan and not Hook. Um, there was a live action Peter Pan movie, and it, it was just called Peter Pan, so I don't really know was how to describe it. Was it the recent one? I have, no. Um, All right, I hate him because he's got a ton of nines, and I'm tired of it. And in this in this live action film, Hook is constantly slaughtering his own crew members. <laughs> it happens oh, on the heel, regular. Heel, heel. heel. I am going through everything. No. I'm counting this as an intentional loss. <laughs> you just wasted all of our items. Why don't you use a zero? Because I'm going to my items. You have to well, use You a have to! He's using a slight! Well, that was keep running around. You're losing on purpose. I am not losing on purpose. <laughs> We've given you the strategy to... You go to the damn zeros! <laughs> you just have to use... <laughs> this counts as on purpose! <laughs> I can't suffer through this anymore. Give me the damn controller. <laughs> this is too painful Give me to watch. I'll, I'll just I'll do it one more time. Honestly, I wish that was intentional. It was so sad. It was, it, <laughs> I haven't played this game in a hot minute, so leave me alone. In a hot fucking minute. <laughs> and by a minute, I mean a whole month. I swear to God, someone's just gonna call it. Did you see that moment? She just threw everything at a slate. Everything she just everything except what it, what would break it. She skipped right past that for some. You literally could have just mashed X and it would have been over. <coughs> All right, I have not played this game in a hot month, so. <laughs> but yeah, this is not a very hard boss. Wait, in what world was it a hot month? It was December. Yeah, it was blistering hot. Maybe in Australia. I was in Australia. Well, that explains a lot. I've never left Australia in my whole life. Does that mean I'm in Australia? We're all in Australia. Just listen to Jaden Smith. <laughs> oh, damn. How can Australia the moment be real people, if our eyes are real? The moment people start saying, listen to Jaden Smith, is the moment I kill myself. This is an okay ideology. <laughs> not, not really, but you know. It, it's the moment when I really want to. Because I can deal with... Or I get annoyed by, but I can kind of deal with SJWs and Weibo keyboard warriors and uh, what's the word? Uh, and, uh, white knights, even though those are all the same thing. <laughs> I can deal with them, but none of Except them are the white as... knight from Cyanide and Happiness. <laughs> <laughs> none of them are as what? As retarded as a, a cult, a mass cult following. Of the ideology of Jaden Smith. Yeah, they gotta join the Nicolas Cage cult. That's where the real cults hang out. <laughs> hey, at least that cult makes sense. Of course it does. Are you telling me that there's something wrong with the worshipping the great Master Cage? How could there be Master Cage else? has proven his power against Christine. Yes, we must... Her him. disrespect towards him resulted in severe punishment. And, and, and I got out of this punishment. There was no such by thing, dying. There is no such thing as blind faith because you have to watch the cage. Of course. Well, now I don't have to play the game yeah, anymore, was, so I'm happy. After watching her scene fight him, I was like, I completely forgot how easy he is to fight. Yeah, it really shows. I gave up. up. <laughs> I noticed. Yeah, I leveled up. <laughs> that is a picture for Hook. Yeah. This looks like his DMV picture. <laughs> <laughs> he was in the middle of a sneak. What are you gonna take the sh <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh... Did we want to build up CP for... I don't know what we're building or... right now. Crap. Um... I'm just gonna do HP right now, then I'm gonna check the deck and find out. I know that for Roxas we need, like, 99 CP. I know that, but, uh... And, that's and still not for a while. Yeah, um, and you can grind off camera. Yeah, I, I plan to do that. Thanks, Peter. We owe you one. Why? He's the one who ditched you guys. <laughs> also, we didn't use him at all in that fight. <laughs> Don't you tell me my controller battery is low. You're low. <laughs> well, now everybody will see how low your battery is, and then you'll be ashamed for the rest of your life and you'll have to go into hiding. Peter and his toxic masculinity not letting the girl go home. <laughs> <laughs> He's a 
Christ, Peter! I'm yeah. Wendy, you can't leave. You listen right here, Peter. I can do whatever the fuck I want. <laughs> the moment you said, I'm gonna edit it. The moment that you said that, I'm gonna put in the clip of, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. We just went full Macintosh. <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> But no, Peter actually is a terrible person if I you know. read the book. <laughs> Look it's at this pointy-eared piss ass. I mean, it's heavily implied that he kills the young lost, lost boys, boys when they get too old. And the pirates are the ones who get away from him. Yeah. And then I mean, he's, he's just like, no, like he's, he's so malicious. He's just like, everything he does that is so was special. one of like, the cool literally... things in Once Upon a Time. Was making was, Peter like the yeah. what they did with Peter Pan. That was which which was really dark. I mean, it was still PG rated, but yeah, but like like the stuff with the shadow was pr- <laughs> the stuff with the shadow was dark. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> uh, no. But no, I mean, like th- this is the kid that held his breath because he believed that the longer he held his breath, the more adults died, and he would do it for like a long I time. I don't believe in adults. <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty messed up thing to do. So he's like, Jesus, Peter, you are one giant I don't dick. get why Captain Hook doesn't really just run up to Tinkerbell and yell out there's no such thing as fairies. <laughs> She'll die if he does that, right? I mean, he, does do, he did do it in the live-action Peter Pan film from, like, ten years ago. I remember, like, we might be thinking of the same film. I remember seeing him do that to a different fairy. Yeah, you know, yeah, live-action yeah, he movie. did. Yeah. Well, she was already dying in that scene, so... Because... Why was she dying in that scene? Because uh, Wendy said she didn't believe in fairies. Or there's no. I, I don't or, know. No, she, it was either because Wendy said there's no such thing I as get fairies. From Peter, or Peter was holding this Moogle hostage. <laughs> and then just giving it away as if it's property. The Moogle Revolution shall begin! <laughs> another list on his. Uh, another one on the list of Peter's crimes. <laughs> yep. Okay. What was the point of that Moogle scene? It was to show... Because that's where you get cards. I don't, I don't know. It was, that didn't happen when we got Genie. Or any of the other else. summons. Or any card ever. <laughs> don't ask me to explain. That's what I'm asking. I demand an explanation. Je- well, Miss Poppins, I demand an explanation. Well, first I'd like to make one thing quite clear. Yeah? I never explain anything. Game. Mary Poppins. What? It's Disney. <laughs> uh, okay, well, I guess we'll see Mary Poppins in the next episode of the Dumb Lawns Play. Kingdom Holy Hearts shit, 3 Chain Memories. I wish. I, I want her in Kingdom Hearts 3. Hey everyone, it's Zaggard here, and I just want to say that was a fun episode, and I'm glad we finished off Captain Hook in only two tries. And this was a pretty funny one, even with that joke on John McIntosh, if you know who that is. And if you do, click that like button, and if you want to see more, click that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the comments.